Well, I think we're still in the process of it changing, and I think it's still in its earliest phase. I think that you can begin to think of light as a lighting plane to where a whole surface might be lighting, or much more importantly, that you have a moving picture. You know, I'm fascinated by the buildings that have, you know, a, a moving image from LED. And to me, I find this one, of, that's what I wanted in the airport for the advertising. The technology was not developed yet. This was 15 years ago. Uh, in the end, the only LED experience I've had was in performance with a, a dancer as a set, and I was fascinated by how it could be used in this context because it offers elements that are more flexible than more rigid lighting of neon and incandescent lighting. But the light quality is very different. Yes, lighting. It's so fabulous. There's a, something about that quality of light that, you know, it's the closest to flame. You know, we're still drawn psychologically uh, to those kinds of lights and because that's the, uh, you know, that's the beginning of, of humanity in a way to experience that kind of light. And uh, I think that was the main attraction to using neon is that you could experience this uh, light as a glowing sort of substance and it created a volume in architecture that was not based on the architecture but became the volume itself. I think the more interesting LED lightings are the ones designed with text, like Ginny Holzer I think is one that I can remember and there's several others, but moving text in fact becomes a very interesting way to, to use it. I'm naive when it comes to more recent there are several young artists who are doing with, dealing with LED. I think in it, its attempt to, um, we all have to address um, uh, the cost and maintenance of, of um, anything that we make. And uh, LED can all, begins to offer a much more, uh, a more simpler, maintenance issues, I think. I think what's needed now are artists to work directly uh, almost as a team with scientists and designers and uh, to begin to try to, to push it in different directions.